Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So if you are receiving this error to fix it, the first step is to end msi.exe services in task manager. So you can make a right click on the start menu and then go to task manager. Now go to the process tab. So here you can see this is the uh, process tab, uh, the first one. So go to the process tab and in the, in the search option at the top type in MSI. Now if you see MSI services or Windows installer services, you can make a right click and then click on end task. And then once you end it, now you can check. If that does not work, in, in that case you can go to details tab. Over here you can see details, these three horizontal lines. Go to the details tab and in the details tab, again you can type in MSI. If you find this MSI exe.exe, make a right click and then click on end task and then click on end process. Now you can try to install it and then check. Still you are unable to install it, then make changes in the registry. Now for this you can go to this location. This location is provided in the video description. Type in a registry editor in Windows search box and then click on registry editor. Click on yes to allow and at the top here you can paste the location and then hit the enter key. Now once you hit the enter key it will take you to this location and here you can see MSI server under this you can see security and then you can rename this security. Now before you rename it if you want you can create a backup of this registry you can go to file click on export and then you can go to desktop you can just name it as backup and then you can for export range you can select all and click on save and then you can just let it complete and then once you have a backup uh, in future whenever you want to restore the backup you can go to file and you can import it so once you select security over here here you can see security you can rename this security to old underscore security so make a right click and then you can click on rename and then just old underscore security and then once this is done you can restart your computer and after the system restart you can check if if you if you face any problem you can just uh, make a right click and you can rename it to the default like security if you face any kind of problem so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this error so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel